Okay, we're continuing on with finger style. And uh, we're going to add another chord, so we'll get the bass notes on that. We're going to add an E minor chord to our repertoire. And we're in the key of G. Last time we did the 1-4-5 progression, which was the G, C, and D major chords. In the key of G, if we count up to the sixth uh, note of the scale, G, A, B, C, D, E, that's the sixth, and it's a minor. Okay, so here is your minor chord. And you notice it's got, it's not as bright as the major chords. It's more melancholy, that's the nature of the minor chords. A little more sad, drawing out a little bit more emotion. The major chords are a little more happier. Okay, so um, on the E, back to the E minor chord, uh, you got some big choices to make here because you're the guitarist. And um, there's two bass notes here. Number uh, the lowest one is in the E note at six open, and then four two. That's an octave higher. That's also an E. Okay, and there's different times when you're going to want to choose those. Uh, for instance, if you're hanging out by the G chord a lot, I probably would stick with the lower note because it's closer to it in sound and physically. Uh, if I'm doing say C D E minor chords. I may go with that fourth two bass note, so it would be like C note, because if I hit the C, then you can hear the little melody, or bass run, bum, bum. if I chose to do the lower one, it wouldn't sound as good in my opinion. So with time you're going to decide. You know when you want to use certain notes, especially bass notes, when you're doing fingerstyle guitar. Okay, so again with fingerstyle, I'm just hitting the bass note with my thumb, and then I'm plucking upward with on the strings, uh, strings three, two, one, with my fingers, uh, index, middle, and ring finger. So we're going to add to some songs that we used before. I'm going to substitute though some minor chords in for the G chords. So we're going to go with uh, start with You Are My Sunshine. Make it a little more dramatic by adding the minor chord to it. Okay, so here we go. You are my sunshine, my only sunshine. So we could add a little bit of different patterns now, um, instead of just all eighth notes. For instance, in 4-4 four, four time, I could play, uh, instead of just all quarter notes, I could do throw some eighth notes in there. One, two, and three, four, one, two, and three, four, or all eighth notes on the, on the plucking part. On the three four time, one, two, two, three, and or one, two, and three, one, two, and three. Those sound a little choppy. So I'm gonna show you like another style. It's more of a folk style. And ukulele players do this kind of style more though. They add what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna kind of strum more by use and use my index finger almost like a pick. So in four four time. I'm going to hit the bass note like I always do, but I'm going to just strum down with the back of my nail almost, or it's kind of like a combination, more of the back of the nail, but it's like a combination also of the finger. You kind of have to feel. It is kind of like the back of the nail that's making the majority of the sound. Okay, because it gives it a little bit louder sound too. So what I'll do is uh, I can do that. I can do all quarter notes or eighth notes just going down up down up with that index finger 
and in three four time it would be down up down one two and three so that's like another way of strumming you have playing with a pick you have finger style playing with the fingers and you can kind of use now your index finger as a pick okay so I hope this is making sense. I hope you're having fun and I will see you in the next video.